It's enough to give your, your doctor a heart attack. So on December 8th, there's going to be a, a landmark study that's going to be prevent, presented by a guy named Matt Budoff, who's a, who's a uh, cardiologist out of UCLA. Basically, what they did was they took 100 people, all who have sky-high cholesterol. We're talking like total cholesterol, 500, 600, 700 milligrams per deciliter. It's enough to give your, your doctor a heart attack. And you walk in there with your cholesterol, it's like 600, what the hell? They are all otherwise metabolically healthy, though. And what they did was they did high-level... CT angiography of these people, looking really detailed at how much plaques in their blood vessels. And when they did that scan, almost none of them had any level of significant, you know, vascular disease. They were like clean, clean arteries. What they're doing on the 8th is they're, they're showing the preliminary data that shows all these people have n almost no heart disease, and they compare it to something called the My heart, Miami Heart uh, data set, which is like, like, the, the, like the, the perfect data set for if you want to compare what's going on with vascular disease. I suspect what will happen is they'll show no progression, little progression, or even reversal, which would be shocking because all these people are saying cholesterol causes heart disease. But if this turns out to be what it, what, what I think it's going to show, which, which it likely will show, then that throws a monkey wrench in that whole, whole uh, theory because it's like, wait a minute, maybe it's a dependent variable. Maybe if you're not fat, you know, out of shape, have high blood pressure and diabetes, that that LDL cholesterol being high is not as much of a problem as we thought it was, which is, I mean, that's really, I mean, that's, that's paradigm shifting, quite honestly.